सी वी नारायण मैनी मैनी कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन टू यू बहुत बहुत बधाई आपको आपके पी एच डी प्रोग्राम एडमिशन के लिए इन द यू एस यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ फ्लोरिडा विच इज वेरी प्रेस्टिजियस इंस्टीट्यूशन थैंक यू सर यस यस सो एज यू नो दिस इज गॉन अ वेरी इन्फॉर्मेटिव सेशन काइंड ऑफ डिस्कशन टू मोटिवेट इन आउट रीच नंबर ऑफ एक्सपीरियंट लाइक दैट यू हैव बीन राइट एंड Why don't you introduce yourself? Tell me from where you come and how you brought up to different various academic background. Sir, uh, uh, so actually, uh, my name is uh, Narayanan. So I am from uh, a township called Kalpakam, uh, which is in Tamil Nadu. So it's a hub of uh, a power plant. Okay. So. so uh, my father uh, work he used to work in ig car uh, which is like uh, research for atomic power indira gandhi center for atomic research yes and uh, i did my uh, schooling there in uh, in kalpakam only okay then uh, i did my bachelor's in uh, Amr- amrita vishwa vidyapeetha Uh, which is in Coimbatore, mm-hmm. and uh, after that I went to uh, like after clearing my uh, entrance jam, uh, joined admission test for masters, so I got selected in IIT Bhubaneswar. I spent mm-hmm. two years in Bhubaneswar, and then uh, like after my masters, uh, I did a uh, like a two month course in analytical. chemistry related course okay. like which covers mass spectrometry chromatography and all kind of techniques mm-hmm. like from there uh, uh, after that i got uh, placed in one uh, pharmaceutical company like it's kind of a contract research organization like uh, it's uh, arigen life sciences okay so you for the past you. two years I, i've been working there in okay. arigen life sciences which is so in hyderabad so you finished uh, your bsc chemistry in 2018 right and then i think you took a one year g- gap right to prepare yes, for yes. some examination how did you prepare uh, for yes. the jam exam sir it was mostly like uh, so actually i had given jam exam uh, the previous year in 2018, 2018. when i passed out uh, like in the year yes. of uh, uh, in the final year of my bachelor's okay so so i knew how the uh, pattern would be pattern of the exam so accordingly i prepared and uh, uh, next year i like qualified the exam with good rank and i got what was your rank iit bhubaneswar sir it was uh, 3 330 something and why you picked iit bhubaneswar for your masters uh, sir uh, like uh uh so some of the options like actually i didn't uh, like i didn't get uh, masters in that old iits so okay. this was the best option among uh, iit varanasi and uh, iit indore okay. so this was the best so i took okay. iit bhubaneswar and when you started thinking about that you want to explore phd program in the us so actually i uh, after Uh, like when i was in masters one day i was uh, thinking i want to do a phd enter exam like csir uh, net mm-hmm. so i tried some project position also okay so uh, since i didn't get i uh, went like i uh, like i took options of, of uh, pursuing my uh, higher studies in outside outside india okay like i wanted to try outside india okay that was your motivation and when did you uh, how did you get to know about our mentorship program so actually uh, like so whenever i go to uh, go into youtube i used to search uh, like phd studies in chemistry phd options and 
I used to go search internet search browse okay. like PhD uh, projects in chemistry related. So mm-hmm. I came through your video in YouTube. Okay. So one of the video was uh, like it was informative. So I like I took a chance to contact you, okay. and uh, now I am here. Uh, yes, I, I that was a very good decision, I would say. Yeah, have you thought about it's, it's online mentorship? I got uh, here. Like, I got. You have uh, any doubts said, with our mentorship before you enroll with? Uh, like I, I like actually I made like it was I used like uh, I watched your videos or around one month before I contacted you. So okay. I was making my decision whether to contact or not. Okay. So I was. Uh, going through all of your videos to make sure uh, it is uh, authentic. Yes. Like it is true. Okay. Uh, so then I contacted him. I think I made best uh, like good decision to go through your sentence. So when did you join us? Do you remember the month? Yes, uh, it was uh, October, sir. And October. Yes. October. Yes. What examination did you take uh, to complete this U.S. application process? Now, how did you prepare for it? Uh, sir, sir, it was uh, IELTS only. Okay. It was, I wrote only IELTS. So, I got uh, around 7.5. 7.5, which is a good band. Yes. I, 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 uh, I concentrated mostly in the listening and reading section. Mm-hmm. So speaking and uh, writing, I was sure that I could co- score some, some, uh, I was already like, I knew English from like my schooling onwards. So mm, I understand listening and uh, uh, reading, I had to go, go through some practice. Mm-hmm. So, uh, yes. So mostly it was that one month was spent on listening and reading practice. One week uh, I was going through mm-hmm. that section, speaking and writing. All right. Okay. Good. Yes. And it was a very good band score anyways. So, so recently, for uh, uh, listening and reading, uh, like mostly it was U- YouTube tests. YouTube tests. Yeah, I think there are so many uh, online mode of preparations. I agree with that. There are so many uh, materials available. Yeah. Yes, yes. So tell me what offers have you received so far? Uh, so far I got uh, only University of Florida uh, PhD okay. offer. Okay. So uh, I think I'm waiting on other offer as well. Yes. So tell me about your scholarship or financial award at I got mails from uh, other university as well. Uh, okay. Yeah. So my uh, University of Florida, they awarded me uh, twenty-seven thousand five hundred insurance and uh, health insurance. Sorry. Okay. Mm-hmm. Stipend and health insurance. Health insurance. Yeah, I think they're covering the stipend, full tuition waiver, plus a medical insurance. And also, I think University of Florida is, I, I think. Uh, one of the top rated institution in the in the US. It's a good place to work with. Uh, we also have some of the students who got mm. selected in the yes, yes. last year also and uh, in 2022 also. So we already have two students up there in chemistry department. Yeah. Yes. So uh, what so is I think it is the, like one of the best uh, public institution. Yes. True. In the US. In the US. How many total applications did you did you put through? Sir, uh, it was uh, 10 applications. 10 applications. And do you remember the name of the university is still awaiting? Mm, yes, sir. Uh, should I name it? Yes, yes. Please go ahead. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, it was uh, University of Florida. University of Kansas. Tell about your your admission offer at University of Florida. Uh, 
sir uh, sir i got uh, like uh, uh, like applied to 10 universities yes uh, so uh, i applied to university of kansas okay university of uh, university at uh, buffalo and the university at uh, albany mm -hmm. and uh, stony brook university okay and uh, i applied to U university of massachusetts mm -hmm. umass and uh, university at uh, university of university of illinois chicago mm -hmm. and uh, michigan state university so these are the 10 university at 10, the 10 universities applied to okay so have you faced any uh, rejections yet uh yes sir uh, like i got a mail from university of kansas uh, saying that uh, that slot have been uh, uh, filled but uh, they also said that if if you if you are interested you can uh, mail after april 14 okay and we'll see about if we can fill you okay and uh, i got rejection letters from university of massachusetts and uh, university at albany also okay rest are waiting <laughs> yes waiting yes, yes, yes. I think yeah, I, uh, I'm pretty sure you will get a few more offers and make a decision. Uh, do you like University of Florida research program? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, I like, sir. I like uh, there are, uh, sir, from what I saw, like there are many options in mass spectrometry research also. Oh, yes. Like there are many professors who are uh, doing research in mass spectrometry. So oh. I have options of uh, going around different labs and talking like have mm -hmm. options more options to pursue which pursue what research i want to do yeah so what you want to become let's let's say you complete your phd what do you want to do afterwards sir afterwards i like i want to go for postdoc like related to this analytical chemistry what mm -hmm. i am doing in phd mm -hmm. then then I want to uh, like go for uh, industry, industry chemical industry related. Okay, so you wanna explore your industrial program? All right. Yes. Many many, but badhai aapko University of Florida is wonderful institution. Anyways, uh, you will receive uh, other offers as well. What about expenses? Uh, uh, till you join our uh, since you join our mentorship until you get your selection, how much? Uh, money you spent till now sir uh, like it, sir it was IELTS cost and the application cost application cost for was around uh, 70000 I, I think it was around 70000 yes and uh, IELTS cost was around 16000 okay so close to 2 lakh and that con ah yeah around 2 lakh sir around 2 lakh yes yes Let's talk about the mentorship efforts called application packet. Uh, in shortlisting universities, scientific CV, SOP, personal statement, LOR, and some other stuff that are required in completion of the uh, PhD applications. Yes. Please say a few words about it. Sir, uh, actually, I had uh, like uh, so I had uh, like wanted some help with my SOP. So, like yes. It, it was a uh, like from your side it was very helpful in part like in uh, sop side like i want to uh, i wanted to write a good sop mm -hmm. like, I, I, I had uh, some uh, like points in my mind but i want to i wanted to like frame it in a proper uh, way proper uh, scientific way like uh, proper essay kind of thing mm -hmm. so i wanted help for that uh, it was a very uh, good sop from your side okay <laughs> and uh, like before uh, like before coming to you like coming to this consultancy service i i like browse some universities i had some universities in mind okay so like uh, like after you like after you help me with listing of this uni uh, listing of those universities that I applied to 
yes. it was uh, like i thought like it was more uh, it was more uh, related to my uh, like my expertise yes can you hear me okay yeah. yes sir yes. Oh, okay good and did you face any difficulty in getting a letter of recommendations uh no sir no sir no like no. Uh, like two two letter of recommendation was from uh, my masters uh, professor okay like one of them was my uh, project advisor okay and uh, one was from my bachelors okay uh, they were all very helpful uh, like in re recommending me sir you did not on take getting my current course. job with the company uh, no sir like mm -hmm. i thought uh, like getting uh, los from academic will be more uh, <laughs> okay helpful i thought i thought like that okay well well so happy anyways sir uh... You want to give some message uh, to the future aspirants, I would say. They will see and they will go through your video and will find the motivation that Naran can do, I mean, explore PhD program. And they can also do. Can, do you want to say a few words to them? Like, I would say that after master's, uh, like, uh, wait, or like, go for some, uh, some, research experience like related research experience then you can uh, like based on what you uh, research you can apply for further studies phd so it will be better if you get a research experience and then go for a phd you know what will you want to do in uh, future that's true very true i agree with that getting some experience especially in the industry can boost your profile as well. And I think there are so many yes. uh, uh, people working in the industry, especially in the pharma industry, and they have a potential yes. uh, job opportunity if they complete their PhDs uh, in the US. And then the job is very highly sought of very highly paid job uh, in the US. I agree with, uh, yes. with you, Narayan. So before we conclude, I just want to say thank you. And then just a few words uh, for our, uh, our mentorship. <laughs> Yes, I, I, I like like I said, I I would definitely rec recommend uh, like me recommend uh, people to your uh, mentorship. Like it was it was very helpful uh, in realizing this uh, like what I have to do, what universities I have to apply to. Like that help was very good. And uh, that's all, sir. Okay. Well, thank you, uh, Narayan. Okay, we will connect, and then we will we'll yeah. see the I twenty and and uh, and also visa processing, and we will help you through. Yes, until you get to the US. Okay, enjoy your time. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Bye bye, sir. Uh, bye, sir. Yes, yes. Bye.